one of our great, we call her the mother of our ex-Muslim movement. And I know it's it's, it's not like a political movement, but we, we, people yeah, like us are okay, a bit activists. Right. Don't worry about it. We, no, 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 that's fine. I mean, I, 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 as atheists, we actually don't like the labels. And we say that if, if the whole world was an atheist, the atheist term would become redundant. Um, uh, but but anyway, so, but, but it does need a little bit of political passion and the desire to change. Sure. If you're an academic, you can rely on your thing. But we, we're trying to, so anyway, so you, you, you had a conversation with um, Mariam Namazi. And Mariam said something that she was upset with Noam Chomsky. And because I am communicating with Indians and Pakistani all the time, and there's a lot of anti-American sentiment, sentiment exists there. And they always quote people like Noam Chomsky because he's like, he becomes their hero. Yeah. But you said, um, so, so Mariam asked you, Mariam said, I'm very disappointed that I agree with uh, a non-American mil- uh, adventurism or military adventurism. I, I don't, I, I think there's a lot of truth in that too, but anyway, that's a different topic. But, um, uh, but he never talks about the, um, you know, uh, women's rights or apostates or blasphemy in, in these Muslim countries. And to which you said that, well, he's only focusing on one thing. He not necessarily, he's not ignoring the other, but it's just, it's just an area of expertise, so to speak. But she still wasn't happy. Then you said that when you get a next opportunity, you'll actually bring that up and ask him about his views. So did that ever happen? Because that interview was about well, a year ago. Norman, I talk all the time, and I, and 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 his concerns about people's freedom are are uh, and and and. And rights are are clear. Um, I, 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 all I can say is what I told her. In some sense, I think Noam's attitude is that other people can talk. You know, he can. T- he's going to focus on things that aren't brought up about the West that need to be said about the West that Westerners need to hear about their own countries, and that's where his interest is. And so. Um, but you know, I will uh, next time I speak to Noam, I, I I will push that a little little more. I guess I'm sure I can't remember after I spoke to Miriam whether I spoke specifically to Noam about that subject. We've brought it up. I think I've brought it up um, when we've had several discussions. When he when he talks about one country or another, and I say, but yeah, but but you know, but the situation is worse here or there, and I, I think he generally agrees. And and so I. Uh, it, yeah, I'm not going to be an apologist for Noam, and and I think um, 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 sh- she's absolutely right that it's really that, and, and you know, I think that's right now it's probably even more important because people people talk about, it, it, especially this woke movement, and you know, the it focuses on on uh, on the crimes of the West and, with and. And without and ignores the crimes of of uh, of people of color or ancient other cultures, and and as somehow there that's fine. But somehow uh, the, the the West has to apologize for for everything it did. Mm. But no, no other country, you know, uh, what's his name? Um, just wrote a book, The War on the West. Douglas Murray. Douglas Murray, yeah, yeah, and he makes that point very strongly. Yeah, but as an educator or as an influencer or uh, someone who has a platform, a large voice, and people like us are always tested, like, why are you always speaking against Islam? Then I say, okay, you know, I have the same opinion about Hinduism and Christianity as well. Yes, because I'm not very well versed on that. That's why I don't talk about it. But well, like, yeah, and, and, or, or, and, and I think Noam Chomsky should make those kind of clear statements. He doesn't have to talk day and night about it. His areas of expertise is that. Well, I'll but talk, at least so I'll people like us. I'll talk right. to him about it. We talk regularly, and it's a good point. And I probably didn't bring it up enough after Marion pointed out. And I hope, as you know, I have great respect for her and admiration for her. To help me produce more videos like these, support me on Patreon or PayPal.